Hey guys, it's Phoenix. It was April Fools yesterday, so that is why I made that video. Um, the responses have been kind of great, actually. Compared to last year, very few people fell for it. That, that's really impressive. Well, some of you guys still asked whether it was a real addition to Minecraft, the uh, night vision cameras. Um, it wasn't, but that's still a reasonable comment in my opinion. I'm very happy with the responses, so I'm just going to explain how I came across this idea to do the, uh, the night vision stuff. If you haven't figured it out, it is a parody of Paranormal Activity. I thought I'd try to stay in contact with the whole new update 1.12 features and that's generally how everything works in Minecraft on April Fools. However, Mojang didn't actually create an April Fools update. This was something out of my own pocket. So, how did I do it? This is going to be a pretty raw explanation. I won't edit too much because I want to share with you how I came across and how I created it and how I filtered it all together. So, if you didn't know, it was a creeper head. So I was using spectator mode on a creeper. And in order to get all the angles, all I did was I teleported the creeper, and I summoned a few creepers here and there, and I just simply teleported his head. In fact, there we go. So that's how I got the really cool uh, green effect, night vision, some of the chunk errors that came about. It creates a very nice uh, filter over the water effect, over the lava, the lighting. It was amazing. I used a mod as well, the sound filter. Uh, I'll leave a link in the description. It's a beautiful addition to survival mode if you want to try it out. I don't create a lot of mod videos. This was an exception last year when I created it. So I opened it to LAN, I summoned another guy, I logged him in, and I jumped in front of the camera here and there. So if you, you can rewind that video, this April Fool's video, uh, I did fly around. Sometimes you could actually see the eyes of the Steve head um, floating around in the background in some of the footage. And that's what I did. I recorded it, and with that, I simply pulled together Creative Commons machine sound effects to, to make it seem like I was flying around with a camera, uh, tried to make it scary. I don't know whether you guys were creeped out over it, but I really tried my best to, to do that. But overall, that's really how I did it. I used some transitions and uh, some text uh, fonts to try and make it seem like I was... Oh, here, diamonds. Um, to make it seem like it was a machine that was flicking back and forth to, uh, to other to other cameras around the place. I was in a ravine. My house, I didn't build a house, clearly, but that's that's just part of this <laughs> part of the story. Don't try to overanalyze it. But anyway, thank you for watching that video. If you missed it, there is a link in the description of this video. I'll uh, I'll leave you to it to watch it again to try and spot Steve in a lot of the situations that I found myself in. But it's just a quick video explaining that it is, in fact, an April Fool's video. If you haven't figured it out yet, there are no night vision cameras, unfortunately, in Minecraft. But it really wouldn't make much sense to add them anyway. Thanks for watching. Leave a like if you found this entertaining and enlightening in some way. And subscribe for more creative content. Thanks for watching. Take care.